All over Africa there is a major war in progress that few people outside of Africa know very much about at all. In the last 10 years it has killed more people than have died in all conflicts worldwide since the Second World War. It kills more people in Africa every single day than HIV AIDS, malaria and measles combined. It is by far Africa's most deadly killer. It is contaminated water. The problem is not a lack of water. Africa actually has plenty of water. The real problem is water management. For a long time a drilled borehole has been the preferred option for delivering clean water to rural African communities. It was found that nearly half of all drilled boreholes in Africa were being abandoned within 12 months of being installed. The reason? A lack of maintenance. Not only are they expensive to install, they're also expensive to maintain. It was the high failure rate of drilled boreholes that prompted our search for an alternative. We soon found something in a remote corner of southwestern Kenya that inspired a solution. It was a simple, easy to build and operate ground rainwater harvesting system that worked. It harvested and collected rainfall directly off the ground and then piped it into a tank. With some easy to apply management and maintenance, this was able to provide a rural community with clean drinking water all year round. By improving this idea, we've been able to develop what we call the artificial rooftop rainwater harvesting system with high capacity storage. It costs less than half the price of the average drilled borehole to build. It can be fully maintained locally, does not have parts that break down, and it can be easily managed and maintained by women. These are the critical points that will determine whether a water point will succeed or not. The system works well because it uses technology which people already have and understand. The system uses an artificial roof which is purpose designed and sits just a few inches off the ground. It does not use guttering. In its place a full length cement trough, just like an animal drinking trough, is located at the low end of the artificial roof to collect the water. The system includes a high capacity sealed block storage tank. The tank is divided into compartments. When one compartment is emptied, it can be cleaned to prevent the build up of mould, while the other compartment continues to provide clean water. The system is fully fenced. Access is via a stile to prevent any intrusion of animals. It uses a simple but effective sand and charcoal filter. The only mechanical parts are two spring action taps. With this low cost reliable alternative, it is possible to provide clean water to every rural community in Africa. All we need to do now is let people know about it. We need to show people that this is a low cost and practical alternative to a borehole. To do that we need to construct a number of demonstration models in key locations so that people can actually see them working. We need you to join us in this fight because this is a war that with your help we can win.